Hello there everybody and welcome into the Matt the Grape channel. In today's video, we're going to be talking all about the latest snapshot of Minecraft 23W07A. The sniffer mob has been introduced. We also have a new cherry blossoms biome, some archaeology features as well. Let's go ahead and jump right on in. So the first thing we're going to go ahead and talk about is the sniffer. This is of course the mob vote winner and I have the spawn egg right here to show you guys what it looks like. He is pretty big, I think bigger than I expected. And yeah, there he is. He will sometimes dig for seeds. He is a passive friendly mob. It looks like he's searching for seeds right now or something like that. Oh, and now he's laying down. And oh, well, as you can see there, he just dug up some torch flower seeds. And speaking of torch flower seeds, that is the next thing we're going to go ahead and talk about is the torch flower seeds. And I think it's called the torch flower. Yes. So. If you go ahead and plant torch flower seeds on farmland, you'll see they look like this. And they will eventually grow up into something called a torch flower, which looks like this. So this will grow up into this. They can, of course, be harvested and you can replant them and continue to reproduce them. Now, whenever you have two sniffers, you can use a torch flower to breed them together. And next up, we're going to talk about the archaeology updates. This includes the brush and the suspicious sand as well as some pot pottery shards that I have here. So let's go ahead and start off by talking about the suspicious sand. You can see it looks a little bit different from normal sand. Here's some normal sand for comparison here on the right. So it's a little more grainy it looks like. And if you go ahead and get out your brush, you can hold down right click on the suspicious sand and it will brush away to see if there's anything hidden inside. And as you can see, there was nothing hidden behind that suspicious sand, so it just turned into normal sand. So you can find a whole bunch of different things inside of Suspicious Sand, and it is found in desert temples and desert wells, I believe, including these things called pottery shards. There's four different types so far, which I have them right here in my inventory. We have the archer pottery shard, the skull pottery shard, the prize pottery shard, and the arms up pottery shard. So if you go ahead and get out a crafting table, and we go ahead and place it down, you can craft these pottery shards into a decorated pot. So I'm gonna go ahead and put all of these into the crafting grid. And the recipe apparently looks like this. Let's see if this works. There you go. So the recipe looks like this They're on the edges there. So we have a decorated pot. Let me go ahead and show you guys what this decorated pot looks like. There you go. It's actually pretty big. It looks like, to me, the Minecraft Dungeons pot. These pots are instantly broken. You can just destroy them with any kind of tool and they will drop back your pottery shards. And if you don't have four pottery shards that you can use for a decorated pot, you can also substitute just normal bricks or brick items. However, that side of the pot will be just blank without an image. And the last but definitely not least thing that we're gonna be talking about is the cherry blossom biome, this new biome. Um, it's got a couple of new items with it, including an entire new wood set. I'm going to go ahead and jump right over to the cherry forest biome, and I'll see you guys whenever I get there. So this is the cherry blossom biome, or specifically, it's actually supposed to be called the cherry grove biome. And you can see we have a whole bunch of different things. First of all, we have an entire new wood set. This is the cherry wood set. This includes, of course, stairs, fence posts, signs, all of that kind of fun stuff. We also have the new cherry blossom leaves. And these things you'll find on the ground are called pink petals. Now, if you go ahead and place them down yourself, you'll see they come in different stages. So as you add more pink petals to the same block, they fill in and they are all across the ground in this cherry grove biome. This is really cool. And it is also a fairly small biome, not too large here. You can see as I'm flying across it, it really isn't all that big. But yes, everybody, that is all for today's video about Minecraft 23W07, a snapshot. Thank you guys so much for watching. Make sure to like and subscribe, as well as check out Discord, Twitter, Patreon, and Reddit links, Reddit links in the description below. Thank you guys so much for watching again, and I'll see you guys in the next video.